gosh, you guys, that is a true story of how I came out to my dad. <laughs> it's a very short conversation. <laughs> We're Italian. Uh, you know. You know, I feel like generally people don't know how to talk to gay people. Like I work with this woman and I feel like no matter what I do, she somehow has to make it about me being gay. No matter what I do. Like I was getting coffee and she was like, that's funny. You even stand in a gay way. <laughs> well then you stand like a cunt, Patty. <laughs> I mean in her defense I was wearing a boa, so it's kinda gay. But I do feel like people are stupid, right? <laughs> Everyone say, yes! <laughs> like, I go into Starbucks sometimes. If they're really busy, they'll ask for your name to put it on the back of the cup. So I walk in, she asks for my name. I say Mateo. She turns around, makes my drink. She comes back. It says potato. <laughs> Guys, she thought that I confidently told her I'd like a grande americana, please. Potato. <laughs> With a P. <pea. laughs> it's a bunch of idiots who work here. <laughs> I am trying online dating, which I feel like online dating, first of all, I'm trying Tinder, which, oh God. I mean, just like the swiping. I cannot be on Tinder because on Tinder, like five minutes into Tinder, I turn into this like Victorian queen. I'm just like, no, no, no. Fine. <laughs> you know, <laughs> we just like ignore each other. But I feel like it's better than Grindr, which Grindr's a gay dating app. If you don't know what Grindr is, it's basically a step above tapping underneath a bathroom stall. <laughs> oh God, I'll give you guys a little bit of a, a little bit of a family history. I am gay. And to add on to that, my older brother is also gay. So my dad is real proud. <laughs> yes. The thing is like, I was a very flamboyant kid. You know what I mean? Like there was no question. And it didn't occur to me that my older brother might have also been a flamboyant kid until my mom sent me some family videos recently of when we were younger. <laughs> it's when the Chicago Bulls won a championship and they're going around the entire house and my whole family's screaming. They're like, Michael Jordan rules! Michael Jordan rules! Then they get to my nine-year-old brother and he's like, well, if anyone rules, it's Janet Jackson. <laughs> and I can just imagine like my mom trying to have a conversation with my dad being like, Steve. I think this one's gayer than the other one. <laughs> what is happening in my uterus? <laughs> it's like, what is going on? Like, my mom is making so many gay kids, you know? It's like a little gay factory. I can just imagine her gynecologist appointment just like, all right, Sherry, we're gonna have a look in here and she <laughs> Sounded like opera. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just vodka tonics shooting out of my mom's vagina. All right, you guys have been great. Thanks so much.